So what is up guys, welcome back and today I'm going to be showing you guys an absolutely awesome glitch that pretty much enables you to have a police outfit in the free mode of a GTA 5 Online and this is absolutely insane. It actually allows you to save it as an outfit uh, which means that you can go ahead and change your clothes and change back to the police outfit in free mode whenever you like. So this is absolutely insane as you all know by now. Uh, the police outfit is not normally obtainable in online and only available uh, during heist missions. So this is absolutely unique and will definitely spice up your character uh, a little bit. So with that being said guys guys as always if you do go on to enjoy today's video or do find it helpful uh, be sure to leave a like down below your support is always greatly appreciated on the channel and maybe share it around as well let other people know about this while they can as this may end up getting patched very very soon so uh, essentially jumping straight into this now the first thing that you guys want to go ahead and do to do this is load up the prison break setup mission that is known as station so of course uh, this is throughout the second heist mission known as prison break and it's one of these setup missions that is known as station now when you're in the lobby you want to make sure that you select the team known as cop station uh, so that you have the cop uniforms on and of course you do need four players to do this so if you do have some more friends that want to do this uh, you may want to take it in turns have two people go as the cops and then afterwards when you've got the police outfits already on you can go ahead and switch out and have the other two uh, go as the cops if they want to get the uniforms uh, and so on and so forth so once you have selected the cop team it should spawn you down into the heist mission uh, with some police uniforms on and you guys will notice in the bottom it should say steal a police cruiser now uh, when it says this you either have two options here you can either fully complete the setup mission and it will spawn you down into a free mode session or you can do the easier way which I didn't do in this video you can go ahead and from this point onwards you can go ahead and straight away just press start and then find a new session so that it spawns you down into free mode so uh, once again once you've done one of those either completed it or you found a new session it will put you down into free mode and don't panic here guys you do not have the police outfit on yet to actually get the police outfit what you guys want to go ahead and do is bring up your phone then go across the quick job then go down to play capture and make sure that you load up a capture through the quick job section and what this will do is it will eventually load you into a capture mission now once again guys do not panic from the capture library you still won't have the police outfit on what you guys want to go ahead and do is simply ready up into the capture itself and when you spawn down into the capture mission you guys will now notice that you have the police outfit on now at this point your next step is to go ahead and bring up your interaction menu then go down to accessories and then change your glasses and what essentially what this does is it brings up a save icon in the bottom right hand corner and pretty much lets the game know that you have changed something and it is trying to save it now I want you have you know changed your glasses all you guys want to go ahead and do is play through the capture mission and fully complete the capture mission now luckily enough uh, it did actually put me into a capture with only one round if there is two or three rounds to your capture job uh, when it spawns you back down into the second round you will have to go ahead and go to your interaction menu again and change your glasses again for every round of the capture job but once again if you are looking like me it should only put you into a one round capture and you will only have to do the glasses part once now uh, once again once you have changed your glasses and you have completed the capture completely and it puts you onto the lobby screen all you guys want to go ahead and do is select free mode and once you select free mode it will now spawn you down into a free mode session with the police outfit on and you are pretty much done at this point all you guys now have to do to save the outfit is go ahead and go to any nearby clothes store it doesn't matter which clothes store that you go to and for those of you who don't know how to save your outfits all you have to do is go up to any cashier press right on the d-pad to browse outfits and at the very top it should have a section known as outfits saved so go ahead and select that then simply press the A or X button to save the current outfit that you have on. You can go ahead and name it. I actually ended up naming mine police, as you guys can see. And at this point, you have now saved this outfit. You can go ahead and select this whenever you want. You can go ahead and change your clothes and then come back to the saved outfit section and uh, change back to the police uniform. And it's absolutely insane. So do this whilst you can, guys. I definitely do recommend that you go ahead and do this as soon as possible because Rockstar may end up patching the glitch. And of course, if you have it in your saved outfits, you should be able to keep it forever. So this this is pretty damn awesome if you guys did find this video a little bit hard to follow I did try and make it uh, as clear as possible at the same time kind of going through it as quickly as possible as well um, if you are having trouble though I will leave a text tutorial down below just in case and uh, as always guys if you did enjoy or did find it helpful and of course if you do want to see more videos like this in the future uh, leave a like down below of course your feedback and support is always greatly appreciated and that definitely shows me how many of you guys actually do support uh, these type of videos as well so uh, once again hope you guys enjoyed be sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel and I will catch you all later with a brand new video.